Main streets and small towns all across Minnesota look more like ghost towns these days with the governor's executive orders in place. Bradley Peterson, executive director of the Coalition of Greater Minnesota Cities, says it's difficult for businesses and small communities to remain closed in areas where there have been few confirmed COVID-19 cases. Some parts of the state where I talk to, to city leaders, they're looking at their communities and you know they live in counties where maybe there has not been um, a significant outbreak yet and they're they're wondering why uh, the small proprietor shop uh, can't uh, open uh, Peterson says towns that are near bordering states are especially noticing the impact in cases especially you look at, at some of the communities on our, our western border especially um, you know they're looking at a lot of economic activity going to north and south Dakota that uh, are a little bit more open. A recent report by Wallet Hub says South Dakota and North Dakota have some of the fewest restrictions in place right now.